Felipe Nazar, so we get you for the full season in IMSA, which I, yeah, finally. Tell me about this opportunity with Action Express, knowing that from Formula One to just frankly everything, Mm -hmm. you've built a really good name for yourself. Mm -hmm. I'm pleased we have you here in IMSA. Thank you. What do you think about this opportunity? I think it's an amazing opportunity and the timing is pretty good because uh, I see the whole championship being so strong this year and the lineup, the drivers, the teams and uh, everything involved, you know, we just, it just seems like it's going to be a very competitive year and I said, as I said before, as a racing driver to be in, a, in such an environment that to, to push you on extremes, to be challenge yourself, it's just great, you know. That's what that's what I want. And uh, uh, you know, uh, after my you know adventure in F1, all I want to see is to is to be fighting all the cars, to be going you know for you know close times and everything. That's what I missed. And I think it's a great opportunity that Action Express has given me. Uh, I always kept pretty close with the boys out there. And, you know, uh, thanks to Jim, to Bob, everyone involved. Uh, you know, I always kept an eye out there for them and. Uh, when I when I was you know watching this transition, I saw the IMSA was gonna get so strong, and then we had the addition from Penske, you know, so many other teams that you know came to join, and uh, it's gonna be a very strong year. That's what I feel, and uh, it's a car that I enjoy driving. Since the you know when I, when I came up, I think it was last year in June or July, I had a goal in the car, and I said, wow, this thing it's it's great for the driver to feel you know, some sort of speed, you know, good braking is a good car to drive. And so we all have fun and that's what we want, isn't it? Tell me about what you have seen in the changes in the series since you were here, uh, you're young, but even younger when you won the Sunoco Challenge, for example, and here in a Daytona prototype, what are you seeing difference wise between the series back then when it was, you know, Grand Am basically, Mm -hmm. and what we have now with IMSA? Are you loving the growth? Oh yes, I'm. I'm. So far, what I've seen is it's it's all positive, you know. Especially from the technical perspective, in terms of cars and uh, the driving, you see. I think that the, this transition was was perfect for the championship. I think the decision to, you know, to merge the series back then was the right thing, and. Uh, you know, we, we got European teams joining us here, and uh, you see the level of competition is pretty high. Um, although I did only those two races back in 12 and 13 here in the in the Rolex, um, but I always kept an eye closing up, you know, like looking at after the championship, all the races by TV, I always followed. And as I said, it's a great timing to be, to be joining because so much has evo- evolved, so much has progressed since then. And uh, I don't see, I see being the strongest championship right now for sports cars. That's what I see. So if we look at one of the other teams, the uh, AFS PR1, P1 program, they call themselves Team (coughs) Columbia because they have Saavedra and Yakiman. You're with the Action Express team, All-American team, Cadillac, but it's almost kind of half team Portugal, team Brazil. There's a lot of teams there. Yeah. (laughs) Tell me about the the dynamic within this team because it is kind of fun. It's Again, it's a very American team, American car, but it's a multi- cultural team you've got mike conway who's completely insane you've got it's uh, fun. Eric, i mean yeah. you, how does the dynamic work with uh, so many different personalities it's it's a fun environment you know i've uh, so i mean i i had spent very little time until now but so far you know we get well together uh we need to get the people speaking portuguese pretty soon <laughs> because they don't understand nothing we say you know when we're talking to each other you know between the drivers and they just you know, they pick up a word in there, you know, so it's it's fun. You know, I, I, I feel like the Action Express team, they're kind of used to it because they had João and Christian for such a long time. And they know kind of the way the Latins work. And um, I think it's a, still a great combination. You know, we got Mike and Eric on the team that are, you know, two experienced guys that has been running sports car for a few years. And uh, it's just a great package, you know. I feel like, uh, you know, we couldn't be, I couldn't be in a better place, to be honest. 